Welcome back to Wednesday's Midday. Well, last night, residents of Avoyles Parish met at a town hall meeting in Mansura, and they, uh, residents and some local officials discussed the need for parish-wide animal control services. Lo local officials say that currently there is no line item in the budget for animal welfare parish-wide. Avoyles has one, only one small shelter in Marksville and two private holding facilities run by nonprofits in Cottonport and Simsport. Residents say the overpopulation of stray animals is wreaking havoc parish-wide. Here's Jay McCauley. Darlene Gormson is a board member with the Avoyles Animal Welfare Society. Gormson says she came to the meeting hoping something would be done in regard to the animal neglect around the parish. German Shepherd puppies were thrown out of a car last week and every one of them died. I mean, people actually throwing animals out of the vehicles instead of just trying to find a place for them. Gormson says the no-kill shelter where she volunteers is over capacity and that there aren't enough volunteers. She says the lack of donations is not helping either. We can only take in so many at our little shelter and we have people fostering for us and we get calls every every day for help and we have to turn so many people down. One of those helping to foster is Bridget Bordelon with the Atchafalaya River Rescue. Bordelon says it's the owner's responsibility to take care of their animals but is calling on local officials to do more once the animals have been neglected. We um, get animals from every town in this parish and the town themselves need to step up and be, um, you know, responsible for having some um, responsibility in, in the animals as well. Bordelon says owners who are charged with animal cruelty often get off with no penalty. She says this allows the animal neglect process to continue. One representative from the Avalls Parish Sheriff's Office was in attendance and spoke on this issue. Not just animal cruelty stuff that is getting swept under the rug. We are dealing with repeat offenders every day that are being cut loose with no charges. If it's an all frost or a PTI. It's a revolving door. Bordelon says there needs to be more resources from the parish. We have to have a place to put them, so we need to start with a shelter in this parish. The Humane Society and Avalls Parish Police Jury Vice President Jacob Coco came together to have the town hall meeting. One of the proposed projects is a parish-wide animal shelter. Well, right now, uh, the parish has uh, several uh, pieces of adjudicated property that the parish owns. And we're looking at taking that green site and erecting a, a, a startup shelter. Coco says the parish is hoping to convert storage container units into kennels. He says he intends to submit a capital outlay request to the state. Those requests are due by November 1st. He says the jury plans to call a special meeting before then to discuss this proposal. He says if approved, the jury would work with a nonprofit on managing the facility. You can count on us to keep you updated on any future developments. For News Channel 5, I'm Jay McCulley.